Lovely. I am your host, Sue Young. And I am your host, Miss Lola. Y'all, look who we have in the building. I said I was going to roll his name. I know he's not Spanish, but, you know, I kind of feel a little Spanish right now. You got to do so, a special. Yeah, so, you know, we have Amari Carrion, Carrion in the building. Hello. He definitely came to stop through the Boom Boom Room. So what's up? What's up with you? What's going on? What's going, what's going on? on? Tell everyone what you do and where you from. I'm from Clay County, Georgia. I do music. I got a new tape finna drop on the 20th. Oh, yeah? Money calling the Empire. You don't know Waka Flocka, do you? You know, yeah. he from Clayton County, too. He be yeah. rushing Clayton County all <laughs> that day. That's the homie. That's the homie. That's the homie. Shout yeah. out to Waka Flocka and Tammy with your fine ass. And, oh, my um, Lord. Just saying. <laughs> 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 and um, tell what do you say? You have a mixtape out going on? What is it called again? Money calling the Empire. 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 Okay, okay. What made you come up with that name? Because I'm bringing scripture to the game. Okay, I thought you was watching Empire. So I was about like, to That's say, what I'm going to name I my I was about damn. to say. You out here trying to build an empire. You had to let people know, you know. No Definitely. You run this shit. So, tell, who, so have you worked with anybody or anything? Have you worked with anybody? Who, who do you work with, as a matter of fact? Who's you on have this anybody mixtape? on Are your you mixtape? Are you on this mixtape by yourself? No, nah, I got Losi. I got Dirty Dave from QC. I got Speed from Bridge Squad. Okay. And I got... Um, I got some more surprises, but I can't tell. ETC, we're going to say et cetera. That's yeah. what we're going to okay, say. Okay, so how come you all, you don't have us on the, on the mixtape? Because we, we got our own mixtape coming out come, called The Boom Boom Room. Because I, be, I beatbox and she sing. Yeah, and then we, like, in, in, in intermission, we freestyle. You know what I'm saying? Everybody in the room, they get on with their verse. They right. just jump on in. So. so why you didn't hit us up? We want to know. <laughs> oh, I'm always in the studio. We can go when we leave here. Oh, snap. Hold, Hold up now. Up. Don't play. We up <laughs> in there. Stop. We ready. We women in black today. You don't need no kind of machines. <laughs> you don't need no machines for the beats. I got the beat right here in my throat. And then, <laughs> hey, and then, hey. Hold up, all hey, y'all. Hey. Hold hey. up in here. Whoa. Only in the boom room. You know what? <laughs> <laughs> hey. Y'all was, it sounded like y'all was waiting on that, too. Hey. They were like, oh, yeah. <laughs> But no, for real though, why you playing though? We really got the um, we got the lyrics, we got the we got the work. So just let us know what studio you go to. So we look, we know to roll up on you at. On Campbellton Road. Right. Campbellton Road, nah. Yeah. Is that still the Cab County? That is the uh, no. That is what county? What county that's is that? Fulton, right? Who? That's Fulton? Fulton County. Oh, Fulton County. Oh, okay, I definitely don't go in the. I'm in the am I what county am I in? Fulton County too. <laughs> Look, she don't go to Panola. I don't Road. go any. I don't, don't go to West Listen, Side. I just don't go there, okay? Unless People, they got good food spots. Yes. That's, I'm definitely on uh what is that? Where is that over there by the mall, South of Cab Mall? Yeah, where she the like, where the um seafood is. <laughs> oh my gosh. They, they got good food, so I mean they got yeah. some awesome food. Especially where all the hood spots are, the grandma and um, grandpa food spots, you know, they got good collard greens. <laughs> <laughs> you were so silly. Fatten you up real quick. Hey, but know. definitely tell us, what, 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 what songs do you have on, on your mixtape that you, that you are inspired by the most? Probably the first one on there What's called that Who I Am. Who I Am. So it's basically describing who you are. So I need I need you to tell people who you are. What, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like I know you from Atlanta. You said you're from Clayton County. I used to live over there. You know, shout out to Terra Boulevard. Does that turn up? Know? Turn up. Ter- I, I live in Terra Courts. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I right, kind of neighborhood. You know, from I Brooklyn going over there. Terra Court. The apartments is pretty is all right. You know, they change it over. They went from Scarlet Place to <laughs> Terra Courts. It's like two neighborhoods in one neighborhood. That's how you know on the line because yeah. I, I used to live over there. For Cause real. he know. Look, he <laughs> like yeah, girl. I he know. Like over there, like yeah. I used to live in both of them. Trust me. You know what I'm saying? I never nah. went to the pool, never went to nothing. I just lived there, paid rent there. That was it. <laughs> Pretty cool spot. It's far off, you know, from way where I live in the woods right now. But, you know, it's a pretty cool spot. I run into a lot of different individuals. Shout out to the D-Mall, which, you know, I know a lot of people <laughs> in the D-Mall because everybody out here hustling, trying to build their empire, trying to do their own thing. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, it, it, it's, it's far. It is far. It's far away from me. So definitely tell people, um, who, who do you want to work with? Who is a big star that you would like to be on the track with? Till Jay-Z. T.I.P. Oh, okay. and Jay-Z. You know, T.I. is so lyrical. And he, the, his big words just really, like, turn me on. Uh-oh. <laughs> Not even about his The new look. tip or the old tip? Because I like the old tip. I like, I like the old tip and the new tip. He was super hood, and then now he's all, like, so. Oh, yeah, on a, on a, he turned a new leaf. Now he done turned a new leaf, <laughs> and now he is so, like. Family-oriented, grown and sexy. 
You know, know what I'm saying? Not, Official though, business. I love T.I. T.I., shout out to you because you, you so. I said my glasses on. I got a little foggy. It's too high. But now, <laughs> does he not talk like he's so professional, right? I understand. Like, he is, like, the most hood professional person I see on, like, the way well, he now, talks and everything. You remember when he had that show, uh, that reality show with when he was reaching out to the children? Right. Uh, God, what was it called? When he was reaching out to the children and, um, I guess, trying to help. Red Dutch. The redemption. The redemption. The yes. Redemption. I know y'all remember that. Don't act like everybody in the room like, oh, y'all don't know. No. Mm. Y'all better act like y'all know. Shout out to T.I. <laughs> <laughs> he is the man. Shout out to my man's Jay-Z. Jay-Z, Tom. yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, they're doing this thing too, but that's what's up. I like so you're not too. in a So you're not uh, in a group with anybody. It's just you solo, right? Yeah, we got a label called Money Calling Entertainment. Okay, so all of y'all are a group, right? Um, how many artists do you have on that label? On um, four right now. Four right now, so y'all pretty close. Yeah. Any female? Until uh, somebody fuck up. Yeah, we got <laughs> one <laughs> female the artist, boat and then y'all cut off the group. <laughs> <laughs> no female artists right now. Yeah, we got one. Okay, what's her name? Melanie uh, Raven Queen. Shout out to okay, Melanie Raven to, Queen. Is shout that out that? to Melanie. Yeah. Cause we trying to we trying to we get trying to get up through there we, we trying, trying to, to get the competition thing. for Nicki Minaj cause she ain't got no real competition right now what's you know going what on we hey wait hold up Remy done came back out she oh came shout back. out to my B I B I this the thing though like you know what I'm nobody <laughs> wants to give the old the old people uh, whoa hold no up kind nobody wants love. to give nobody wants to give no, royalty not, they're not old royalty. But nobody wants to give royalty you know what I'm saying because that's where that's where it should go to like <laughs> Remy Ma and I love I love Eve I'm sorry I those love yeah Eve. you know Eve what I'm is a, she is an awesome rapper and I know I haven't seen her in a while but I haven't seen I her I seen her she was anything. at Sweet Lounge shout out to Sweet Lounge <laughs> <laughs> but I'm saying I haven't heard anything from her mm, lately yeah. but you know what I'm saying Eve is also an awesome rapper and um definitely Nicki Minaj he is an awesome rapper and I love Lil Kim why they be talking about her so bad you know what I'm saying like I, I mean her. if it wasn't for Lil Kim Foxy Brown um That's Nicki Minaj true. well not even Lil Kim Foxy Brown yeah Eve I'm trying to think of who else you know it's just those individuals set away all of their different personalities and their swag and their style set away for Nicki Minaj to be the individual that she is today so since we are speaking about that who is your favorite rapper and we gonna count it down from five it don't even have greatest. to be a rapper favorite it could artist. be anybody yeah. favorite artist from five to five being the greatest I'm sorry two number one so he's your least favorite no, no. You're number oh, one. Oh. Five being the great, your okay. your best, oh, okay. your best so rapper. Least okay. of best. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I smell the herbs in the air. Rocco. Number five. Rocco's number five. For R and B. That girl Amanda Perez is. Amanda dope. Perez. I like yeah. Amanda really? Perez. Yeah. I haven't heard that name in a minute. I like Amanda Perez, <laughs> too. <laughs> Definitely. Hold on. He brought that back. Look, I'm like, damn, Amanda Perez. Oh, that was, shit. I that know. Was, um, yeah. That was God's an angel. Yeah, yeah that's her. Yeah. That's her. She was straight thug, for real. <laughs> that's what's up. You know, you remember Lumi D? Yeah. But we're going to talk about that she later. She was go a ahead, thug in a dress. <laughs> but go ahead. Who else? <laughs> she, was. she was. Amanda Perez. We love you. <laughs> that's crazy. I want to know what she got going on. We need to get help in I don't through know. Here. What's number, what's number uh, uh, three? Number three. Right, let's see. Number one. Number you got three. that many? Are you trying to calculate? Right, I'm trying organize. to see. Let me see. Which one is? Yeah, because you, you, no, you're thinking okay, overall. Well, let it not be no order. You just say whoever your favorite is. Whoever okay. on your top. I want to know who Lola's favorite top is, too. Mm. You never said it. Oh, I like Papoose, too. Papoose? Yeah. I like Where Papoose, too. Shout out to Papoose. He's been waiting on his queen to get out, boy. They the real M. Look, hey, shout out to Papoose. They will be on new uh, oh, okay. Love and Hip Hop Oh, yeah, New York. I saw that. I definitely saw that. Okay. Yeah. Who's so who about to get real because they got a real a real chick on there. Brooklyn. Can't say bitch because, you know, people get Don't nobody want to fight her, either. They better not. She just got out, too. <laughs> <laughs> she Ain't nobody trying to fight her. <laughs> You don't know what the hell she doing to you. Hey. So we got I gotta T. say I. We got Rocco T. I. Papoose, Amanda Perez, and who else? You know it gotta be the King Jay Z number one. Jay Z number one. Okay. Jay Z. Definitely Jay Z. I like that. 
Jay Z. Lola, yeah. who is your top five? <sighs> Omg. Okay, I would definitely have to say Eight Ball MJG. What? I love them. Memphis. Eight Ball, I love. I it. gotta stay. They kill me with the nine millimeter. I love that hey. song to death. I know all the words for all y'all she that is don't a know. I'll be up in the car with my tinted windows, rapping to that anyway. <laughs> oh I love gosh. Outcast. Outcast is definitely on my top. I love Outcast. Beyonce, she's definitely on my top. Cause she is such an artist, and I love Beyonce, and I definitely want to uh, probably um, back in well not back <laughs> well back in the day, Little Kim. She she is still on my top. What? And yeah, she's still on my top because I so love you, her. You ain't tell me rap group. You said rapper. I know she done. You name, gonna name she done group. the shit up for herself. <laughs> you know, I didn't know you that name we had group. I didn't know we had. She done added two know. people to her one. Like what kind of cheating ass shit is that? <laughs> what happened? What, what, what I did? did? I what, I do? what I do? What I do? <laughs> <laughs> hey, they as one. Are they? So that's like me one? saying, "Oh, I love Three Six Mafia." They go together. Do they not go together? So when she said Abel MJG, she really mean Abel MJG Three Six Mafia. <laughs> um, uh, 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 what's her name? Oh, uh, dang. Dang, what is her name? She was coming to the show, too. Oh. Dude, I just, she was. Okay, it was all of them. Dang, why wow, I forgot her I got name. a lot of tops, though. I dang. love Mary J. Blige, too. Mary How J. you ever get, okay. Okay, so my turn. Uh, yeah. Definitely, I love Jay-Z, of course. Yeah. Kanye West. Yeah. He is the man's. Yeah. Um, I like, y'all might think I'm crazy for saying this. I like Christina Perry? No, oh, Christina, Christina Perry. Christina Perry, she sings um, that song. Thousand Years. A thousand, a thousand Years. Everybody's getting married to that It's the soundtrack now, for you know. Twilight. Um, Y'all never you know heard that song? song? Y'all don't listen to pop or anything? No? Nothing other than rap? Oh, okay. I have died every day. You, I know y'all heard that song. So y'all don't Whoa, listen to up. nothing else. You Are can't you limit yourself. Me? Don't you be just trying to, to crush be, on my list. You have to be well-rounded. Okay, what is wrong and with I'm that? well-rounded because I mix with so much different stuff that I have to attend to all different stuff. You have to be well-rounded. So Christina Perry, she sings that song. I have died every day waiting for you. Darling, don't be afraid. I have loved you for a thousand yeah, years. Everybody get married I know to that song. That's yeah. what oh, y'all like. It. That's my trash, okay? <laughs> oh, you need to get married so you get so silly i love hey. i love um music soul child oh yes uh, yeah he Woo. and jasmine sullivan of course you definitely i like I, i'm a soulful kind of you know what i'm saying i like avant too i'm sorry I can't he do put five me in because mood. i got a long list i got right put me in the mood shout out to popcorn <laughs> shout out to sanchez shout out to you know what i'm saying like, my trini accent gotta bring that in there too you know what I'm saying? Lot, you know what i'm saying shout out to egyptian i will be at centennial park this sunday for the PXP Festival, Caribbean Festival, Akon's hosting. I'm going to be there in my costume. You know what I'm saying? We got a lot of different people that's going to be out there. Um, if you ain't doing nothing, Mr. I'm in the studio all the time. <laughs> you better be up there. Try to come out. We're going to be at Centennial Park. Y'all go to Eventbrite and get them tickets. Okay? So are you trying to make any videos or anything? Because we need any? to be up there twerking, bro. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I think we got a new <laughs> video we shooting on, on Saturday with Hall of Mirror. Shout out to Hall of Mirrors, too. Okay. Okay. So we want to know. Um, oh, so you were just going to be up in here. Didn't say nothing to the boomer room. <laughs> we coming for do you. you have a, do you have a girlfriend? <laughs> Don't put me on the spot I'm like sorry, that. I'm sorry, Mrs. Don't put uh, me on the spot Cardell. like that. Anyway, you just got cut Don't off. put me on the spot like that. Don't <laughs> sorry, put me on the spot Cardell. like that. <laughs> you know what I wanted to ask? Because I was thinking about this hey. thing. Don't I was put thinking me about up. this. I took it way I'm back. I'm a stutter. I'm a stutter. <laughs> I'm a stutter. I'm a stutter. <laughs> That's what he wanted to say. Hey. <laughs> While y'all playing, though, I wanted to take it back to when I was in high school. Now, I know everybody in this room, their first job, you got to start somewhere. When you're in high school and you're eager to get to that money by any means necessary, Everyone has had a first job. Now, I know y'all see the Sue Young I am today. I, I put up a little throwback pictures today on mine. So a couple people didn't know I hoop. A couple people didn't know I was thugging back in the day. Don't get it twisted because I still get it Let popping. everybody know. Yeah. Share, it. Share it as day, much as you I'm can. I'm a Brooklyn chick at heart. <laughs> yeah. Nah, I don't, I, you see I'm dressed business attire. Share it as much as you can. With my glasses on trying to be very yeah. well, you know what I'm saying, educated and be all cool. Yeah. Don't let it fool you. But at the end no, of the day, she's a thug in my real first life. job, I want to know what your first job was. 
<laughs> she just cursed out the nail people the other day. I feel so sorry for because them. Because they had me in there for two hours. And I was in there. They was in like, ching, ching, bong, 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 bang, 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 talking all that shit. And I'm in there <laughs> trying to get my nails done because I had a video shoot to go to. And she over there, she speak v- Vietnamese, so she know what the hell going on. And she ain't telling me because she know I'm on fire in the inside. <laughs> <laughs> I paid every, I paid and walked out, didn't tip nobody. I tip everybody big when I leave about the nail salon. They, oh, so young, baby girl, we take care of you, you know. We love you long time, <laughs> baby. We never let you wait. <laughs> but they made me wait two hours and pissed me off yeah they but did piss you off <laughs> not trying to change the subject my first job aside because i had two first jobs i worked at fat street wear in conyers fat next street door wear. To oh my god How i worked there when i was that? 15 years old you know what i'm saying and i worked at chuck e cheese for two years because i was determined to get that check get that check it don't necessary. matter what it is if i was in there fixing the games you know what i'm saying giving out the tickets for the prizes i didn't care i wasn't in the chucky suit but, you know, I was out there hustling. And I know everybody had a first job. What was your first job? I want to know. You know what I'm saying? Y'all um, my first job, I was 14 years old. I was working at McDonald's. So you just got to beat me back by a whole year. Yeah. <laughs> I was working, working at McDonald's, and then I got fired. Shout out to McDonald's. I got fired <laughs> for drinking some orange juice. Oh, hell no. Where, yep. where, which McDonald's was that? Because I'm going to go up through there. On 138. By Kroger's. Yep. I hate y'all. I am, they I fired me because I drunk some orange juice. The lady, she was hating on me because all the guys that come through there, they was trying to stop and get my phone number while they was at the front counter. So she got mad. She was kind of like, she was white, but she was a hood white girl. You know how them hood white girls be? They be trying to like take oh, your spot. Oh, no. Them the ones, the white like, girls oh, with the braids. They got that ponytail in their hair with the curls in the back. Smack and they be them trying to, your God, them they got the swoop ponytail. They got the swoop right here with the gel on their ponytail. So they know, you know that they, they fucking with a black dude yeah. when they got that ponytail. Right. They got the ponytail. ponytail. Yeah. So she fired, she fired me. A cigarette. I went up there, got my last check. I said, I'm out of here. I went to work down the street at Checkers. She was, you was a manager, too. Yep, I was a manager at Checkers at 17 years old. Shout out to Checkers for Shout holding it down, P.O.P. style, baby. Love them they Checkers the fries. They hot. I love your fries. Your shakes be good as hell. <laughs> Let me, I went through hell with that job. What was, what was, your, your, first what was your first job? What everybody was your first job? Everybody started somewhere. Where's your first job? My first job, I was 16. I was working at a car wash in Stockbridge. Washing them damn cars. So yeah. I need, oh, let me tell you, are you going back to detailing? Because my car, it kind of need a little. Uh, no, ma'am. It kind of need a little spot check. The music. Uh, no, ma'am. No, you're we not can going go, We can run it through the $3 car wash, though. The $3 car wash. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Okay, I'm a cheap date. We going. <laughs> <laughs> hey, the car going to be squeaky clean. That car going to be squeaky clean. It's $3. It's so silly. It in ain't my, much no more, man. But in my damn. whole time of, you know what I'm saying, getting to the money, trying to be you know young hustle do my own thing you know you take advice from certain individuals there's a lot of ogs and different individuals that try to give you advice that think they know what they're talking about but i mean what was the worst advice someone has given to you in the process of you trying to attain where you know your goal and where you're going like what what can you say was the worst advice and i'm talking to you he's looking at lola like lola what 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 did they tell you lola (laughs) i'm talking to you (laughs) <laughs> the worst is right. Because I know I hear some the worst crazy advice shit. you've ever heard. Me hanging out on the stoop to you. in the trap with my snap back, with my my boom boom room juice. You know what I'm saying? People be saying some shit now. I be what hearing. Te- what what the did they tell be you? Be talking. What have they ever told you? We want to know. Bad <laughs> advice <laughs> I ever got. I could tell y'all some. Don't shit. work for the white men. Did they tell you that? <laughs> no, they did said they, go, they on work. That? <laughs> go, you you go to work. Nah, I grew up. You gotta have money. Uh, bad advice I ever we got. Don't let him think about that. Yeah, yeah, all right, yeah. Because you know what they told me. You gotta go to school. You have to have a nine to five. You have to, have to, have to, have to. You don't have to do shit. You gotta do what you're supposed to do. You gotta do what you wanna do. Because at the end of the day, like we was talking to Mr. Stevie, if you are chasing the money, which we're raised to think that is the right decision, then you ain't gonna, you gonna be broke. You just gonna be going in circles. You gotta learn to chase what your dream is, what you believe in, what is best for you. Cause what's best for you may not work for the next person. Like a lot of people go to, there was a lot of people that went to my school that left and rushed into college, and they all not in college right now. They all working at goddamn Walmart, Sorelli's, goddamn dollar store. Shout out to That's a hustle because I am not stopping nobody hustle. You get your money. But at the end of the day, a lot of people that was forced by their parents to do what they thought was best for them did not work out for them. And they wasted their money. They financially and all that shit on an on a, on a education that they are not. And now you got a purpose. bad job, bad credit, bad looks, bad hair, bad shit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> 
now you fucked But if up. you did what you thought Bad you was the, what you wanted to do up. at the end of the day, like for me, you know, I, and I learned at the seminar the other day, I was sitting there from one to five, my eyes was burning like hell. I said to myself, damn, if I go back to being in the classroom, who God, I don't know if I could sit through this whole class. No snacks, no no breaks, no nothing. Like, no hall pass there, to like, go to the snack machine. You know what I'm saying? I paid for my education. To the bathroom, it's totally nothing. different now. So it's like, damn, I know what I love to do at the end of the day. I can't let what someone, somebody else think is best for me, you know, tell me that, oh, this is going to work for you, blah, 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 all other stuff. All right, shout out to the five. <laughs> <laughs> Our kids you stay know? in school, though. You might, yeah, definitely. you get your education. Children, we don't need school. no dummies. Get your academic, but, your your uh K through tw- your K through twelve. We gonna need y'all to get that. But if you we ain't talking really, about after that, you yeah. know. But K through twelve, we gonna need y'all because those are the basic fundamentals. Okay, that you must get. we need you to learn how to count to five. Which they and lucky because I think they don't have read a, the book. I think they don't even have a graduation test no more. So y'all are actually lucky. There's y'all are lucky. Why? You know how many times? You know how many times I had to take the graduation test? I had to take that shit two times. Not because I'm retarded, because I I failed the science part. I had to take the science part. the science part. So damn time. We had to take this God damn. so many damn times. And time. we fell about two or three points, and they not giving that shit to They ain't you. giving it to you. The old heads. I had to go back in my pajamas to take that science part. That's fucked up. Rodell? <laughs> it's all good. It's still y'all. love. But you said stay in school. I know, look. What was look, the worst good, advice, though? He what was the wor- That's the best advice, but what's the, what's the worst advice? You know, people just be talking. Nobody ever told you to do some dumb ass shit. And then you was like, damn, he told me to do that. Some dumb shit. I ain't never listening to that nigga again. <laughs> you know, ain't nobody ever told you that. He trying to save people right nah, now. I you really ain't got to throw no names. We don't want you to get, you know, you know, you people, know what happens on Peter Street. We ain't trying to get that happening. I try to block here. stuff like that. I, I don't even remember, really. To you be don't honest. even remember? That's good. I don't you hang with nobody. Out. That's good. So you, what's your sign? Leo. Oh. Shout out Leo. to the Leos in the building. Leo, so you know who all them Leos is. I'm a damn Pisces. Hey, my fellow Leos, y'all so cute. Look at y'all over there. I hate y'all asses. Don't y'all nobody so care. Cute. I'm a Pisces. Oh, I swim by Pisces, myself. She, she mean. Okay. <laughs> y'all be fishing for Pisces. I'm staying over here in the water by myself. Safe Look, we done. lions. We gonna eat your ass. That's not right. <laughs> He's too cool, too cool, too you laid too, back. I knew cool. that. That's why. I thought he was a cancer or a Leo. I knew it was a cancer or a Leo. He's I was like. A, he's definitely a Leo. He's definitely a lion. He rock. Yeah. Getting it. Turn up. Dang. So where can they find you at? Do they, you have an Instagram or Facebook? Yeah, my Instagram is a Mari Cardion. I-M-A-R-I-C-A-R-T-I-O-N-E. Do they have to put a lot of R's in there when they put it in? Or do they just put one R? Oh. No, just one R. Okay, cool, cool. Well, really, two. It's really two. See, yeah. I told you they had to roll it a little bit. Yeah. They had to roll it real short. Well, yeah, all the, social media, yeah. all the social media, you can find me on that. Okay, okay. Please tell them about your mixtape one more time. One more time. Let everybody know. And I need know. you to introduce that video we Listen up, y'all. Listen. My mixtape called Money Calling the Empire. It dropped on the 20th. I got a lot of special guests on that, so y'all be waiting for that. It's going to be on iTunes, and it's going to be on live mixtape, Spin Rilla, et cetera. You know, my boy Holla Mary shot this video called okay. Money Conversation. Be mad at you because you ain't call us, but it's all good. It's the love. <laughs> We're going to turn up on the word. And tell them what the video is. You ain't tell them. Yeah. It called Money Conversation. Money, money conversation. conversation. Everybody yeah. trying to have it ain't about the money. Hey, we ain't talking if it ain't about the money. So juke. she a rapper hey. now. Hey. She we a rapper. Hey. <laughs> she a rapper, y'all. I told y'all. But you know what I'm saying? We about to tune into this video right quick. So, so y'all definitely go follow us. Follow us, please, on the Boom Boom Room 7.com. We do show love. We do like pictures. Definitely follow me at Who Needs Them. And y'all follow me at SU3 underscore YUNG. Um, y'all can stop following her because she kind of has 12K and I only have 1600. <laughs> so if you guys want to follow me, that's okay. Hey, it's all love, baby. We out. <laughs>